Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So as you would have seen by the title of today's video and my Instagram post um, yesterday, this is in fact the new horse reveal. Um, so I'll be going and getting her in just a second. But I did film a few clips of getting um, her bed together and like her stable made and everything beforehand. So I'll insert these videos here and you can have a little watch of me make her sunny bed bed up. And then I've got an exciting... Um, Gotta believe there's something that'll give you relief. There's something that'll have what you need, what you need. We're broken, it's tragic, we're not all elastic. But maybe there's magic, believe you could have it. And I know of sadness, the anxious and panic, the infinite vastness of all that. at the back of the lorry where Dan travelled down in. So I just need to take that to my heat now. Sorry, the the roof is being down on there. Hello. In the same spot, back again after you've just watched those videos. So this is the very exciting product. Um, obviously it's for Diane, this is why it's in this video, but it is from, let me just hide my dress, Blaze Equestrian. So can you guess what is in here? Can you guess? No? Well, I'm going to be filming an unboxing for you. Um, honestly, I cannot wait to try it on her. I cannot wait to look at it. I haven't even looked at it yet. I've literally been waiting to film this video to even open it. So, yeah, let's get into it. I wanna be the best in the game, invest in my name, check no restraints, I'm obsessed with the pain, I ingest, I retain, assess and I change, possess- See, this, like, isn't even half the rug, so, I'm gonna pause it now, pause the video now, and comment down below how big you think Diane is. I'll give you a little hint, this rug is six foot nine. <laughs> Honestly, how gorgeous is this detailing, though? So, it says blaze there, and then it has- blaze on the straps and oh i absolutely love these straps because these are the handiest things ever i honestly i don't like these yeah they're fine but i always prefer these for the belly straps because they're just so much easier to undo so if you're going to use this rug as a show rug which i'm probably going to use um it for then it's just so much more handy to just take off the horse and these are detachable straps so you don't even have to don't even have to um, have the straps on if you don't want to because yeah, you can take them off both sides, which is perfect. Honestly, these rugs look exactly like the Kentucky rugs. Oh, it's so fluffy inside as well. It's got fox fur all throughout. So let's go and try it on her. So yeah, see you in a minute. <laughs> Okay, the 
grand reveal. Look how smart she looks. <laughs> Good girl. You look so pretty. Very nice rug. We'll use that for shows, won't we? Yes. So at the at the front, there's these fasteners, but there's also Velcro in there, which is good. And then, like I was saying earlier, there's the straps that you can attach or detach on both sides with the little clips. And obviously, it's got the tail. I haven't actually done this yet. I haven't um, set it. I still need to do that. But yeah. And then obviously it's fleece lined all throughout. She's changed head collars because we, um, what's it called? Took some photos of her in the rug for Blazer Question. Actually, I'll leave that at down below here uh, for you to go and look them up on Instagram. And whether you want to buy or just window shop, it's definitely worth having a look at. <laughs> Good girl. So she joined us on Wednesday. So we went and traveled down to London on Tuesday, rode her for the first time on Tuesday, only for about 15, 20 minutes, just walked up canter. Then we stayed overnight and we brought her back Wednesday, um, where I actually jumped her in the morning, which was really good. So yeah, she's called Diane. Her show name's Diane Second. She's 13 um, and basically before I had her and before the owners had, the previous owners had her, uh, she was in the Netherlands. So she was imported over from the Netherlands where she jumped about 130s um, and she has so far in the UK she has a BS record of about 120, 125. So plenty of scope on this horse, um, which I absolutely love. Um, and yeah, so she hasn't actually been BS since 2019. Uh, she's had a like a quite quiet past couple of years. Look how small she makes me look. Like I am five six, five seven. She makes me look tiny, absolutely tiny. But I've always said that I love big horses. Obviously Jarvis is, well, I thought Jarvis was 16.3, but if she's 17 hands, I think Jarvis is probably more about 16.1, 16.2. No, he's probably about 16.2. Um, you're just a big girl, aren't you? But yeah, um, so the aims for the next few months slash years are to obviously just get her a bit fitter. She hasn't been in much work, so we just need to get some more muscle on her. Um, and then we'll start getting her out. We'll get her out to some arena hires first and just see how she is jumping, build up our partnership a bit more before we take her out to some BS shows. Then obviously we'll affiliate her and get her out to some shows, but we've got plenty of BS Academy training booked for over this winter. So um, we'll enjoy doing that. And yeah, so basically keeping you outside with Jarvis, because some of you might have seen that Diane actually stayed with Jarvis at the stable last night. No, we haven't solved Jarvis, don't worry. Um, Jarvis is just out in the field and like I've been saying on Instagram he's just having a quiet little um, break at the moment whilst I got Dora back fit and now um, mum's been riding um, mum's been riding Jarvis more because obviously now I've got Diane and she needs to get a bit more fitter before we take her out show jumping so uh, yeah mum's going to continue riding her for a little, him for a little bit more uh, just until I get Dora and Diane back up and running and then I will start jumping Jarvis again probably so yeah, that's all about her. I'm sure you guys, like I can't wait to uh, see her out in action and make some more YouTube videos with you. She's honestly the sweetest mare ever. Um, she's such like a people's horse. So she'll walk up to you in the field. She's, she's not marish at all. And yeah, you're just a BFG, aren't you? Look at these big ears. Look at your big ears. <laughs> you're just massive, aren't you? You're a very good girl, aren't you? Yeah. So I'll probably be jumping her on Monday next week. Um, but yeah, that's Diane. You can't set yourself free. So you've got all that to look forward to. But in the next few clips now, um, there'll be some clips of when I went to try her. And then, <laughs> good girl. Uh, clips when I went to try her and some clips of me riding her earlier today. So yeah, enjoy. And I hope you love Diane as much as I do. <laughs>
Anne's just finishing off her food. Licking the floor. <laughs> She's like, good dinner. Got it all over your mouth. <gasps> Got it on my head collar. Got your head collar dirty. All up your snout. <laughs> so, just gonna let Diane back out of the field now. And then, yeah, that's her done for the night. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope you like Diane as much as I do. She's very pretty. Um, and yeah, there'll be plenty more vlogs. All right, what are you doing there? <laughs> there'll be plenty more vlogs um, to come of her. So yeah, keep an eye out, turn your post notifications on and I'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye.